Hello everybody, this is Ratsamelius coming at you with another Minecraft episode. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Where are we? Some of you may know, not many, judging by the views. <laughs> Previous season, I wanted to check something out, but we'll get back to we'll get to this in a second. I want to say thank you. There's been a bit more activity on the channel recently. So I'd like to welcome all the new subscribers. I hope you are enjoying the content. And thank you for joining us. Uh, secondly, the episode after this, we'll, we'll go check out. I got a lot of the trail done in the villager area. So we'll check that out. And then we're going to do, like I said, exploring. But we're going to do a little different. We're going to do some caving, cave exploring over by the villager area in the hopes that we find a lush cave system because I really need a lot of moss carpet so it'd be great to find one of those in general but I wouldn't mind just you know digging up some digging up some some moss carpet so okay this area this is last season's area so upstairs up that way is the main base area I'm not gonna we're not gonna tour the whole thing there's a whole season's worth of videos to check out if you want to check that out one thing we are gonna do oh look at this <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> I've cooked cod in this world, apparently. Down here is my entrance to the, my nether portal that I made, and I really liked it. It is a it is a portal inside of an amethyst geode, and I was thinking about this because now that the amethyst shards glow, I wanted to check it out again quick. So let's go check this out quick. It's, this is kind of like a construction site is the way I wanted to make it look. And here we go, an RTX, woo hoo hoo. Wow, that, uh, huh? That brightened it up even more. <laughs> it was pretty bright to begin with, but wow. Okay, yeah, I just wanted to check that out. Should we get down in it? Let's get down in it. Oh, yes. I like this this nether portal area, it's pretty cool. But I just wanted to check this out quick with you guys because these glow now, and I just wanted to see how that looked with the glowing shards. So there it is. Anyways, let's get to the Villager Vacation Villas to show you the trail quick, that I, the trail progress, and then we'll get underway exploring. Alright, so here we are in the Villager Vacation Villas in our current season. And this is what I got done. First of all, what I wanted to do, like I said at the end of the last episode, is move these back. But what I also did, and I think that really helped, let's stand back here a little bit, is I brought the purper and the, the smooth sandstone slabs down a half a block. Because I was originally, like, what I said was I was just going to make these a full block and so that that would connect there. But I like, ooh, why don't I just take it all down a half block? I think that looks better. Kind of tighten it up. It doesn't, there's not as much of the nether brick in there. I think it's good. I think it's good. Way better than what it was. And it was just a little fix. Not too bad at all. And then the trail here, I had this part done already. But then coming up this way, I just kind of put these here. We haven't finished that way. But this way, we got the trail mostly done here. I put these in here and there. And then some of these weeds from the nether at the base of it just to kind of give it a little, ground it a little bit. I also put some some vines on there. They haven't grown down all the way. I want to see what that looks like. I'm not sold on that. But I want to see what that looks like putting the vines on there to see once those grow down, if it kind of grounds it more into this type of biome makes it a little different and we'll go up there in a second and then over here i got the trail coming all the way this way kind of go under this nether tree here and it goes down here added these of course which is the same type of lamp another one of those trees down to our fishing villager area so our fishing villagers in there of course and then and then these are just going to oxidize over time i'm okay with that and it looks okay like this i guess but it'll be nice if it's kind of matches this but just a little different and then I haven't done anything up over there but then this area I'm kind of proud of this area so here's the staircase up to the librarian up there I wanted to kind of match this with that just a little bit more as you're coming up the staircase and there's a plateau here I was like wow what could I do in here how about a little fountain pondy area huh like right in there I like that kind of added some ambiance in this area something to look at and then up here, not much going on. Just the path goes into the into the librarian village area. So I hope you like these improvements so far. And we're going to get on to 
finding a cave to explore in. And it's going to be around here somewhere. I have not looked around this place much at all. I don't even have a map on me. So I'm going to write down these coordinates. Because <laughs> I think I have them written down somewhere where this is. So if I get lost, I can find my way back with coordinates, right? And then we're going to start heading over that way. So we'll see you en route. All right, so there's our village under construction over there. And we're just kind of heading this way, trying to look for a cave. One other thing that I am actually looking for in a good quantity is more coal. I keep talking about it. It just is not a resource that seems like it's readily available. I'm not running out. I got plenty in the furnaces, but I want more, more coal. I've got, uh, you know, I got to feed those villagers some coal too, right? Is there like just a weird one? Cow down here. Let's see if this goes down to something. That'd be kind of silly. This is a little entrance, right? But it could turn into something big. It could turn into something big. Let's take a look. Let's see. That's the way the caves work these days, right? They're small and then see, it keeps going. It keeps going. Do I want, I'll just do cobble. Oh, hi. Oh man. Hello. There we go. See, this might turn into, oh, do I have shears? Oh. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. This is going to turn into something. This is going to turn into something. It is. Let's see. Let's see if there's some coal in this area first. I have a feeling we're onto something here. This is kind of a neat little one high cave area. Oh, okay. Let's go this way. I'm surprised there's no coal down here. But let's go this way. No, nothing over there. Oh, this goes outside again. We don't need that. And I think there was something else down this way. Let's take a look. Yeah, this goes down more. Let's go down this way. I do have more torches. I'm hoping to get coal as we go so that I can make some torches. But I think there's something down here. I also like to grab these. Those of you that have caved with me know I like to grab these here like this. Boink. I love my glow lichen. All right, this way. Yeah, this is going to definitely get into something bigger. And I'm hoping it's a lush cave. <laughs> And I'm hoping it's a lush cave. Anything back here? No. Coal, please. Coal would be nice. Copper. I uh, don't really need it. I have a ton of copper. Uh, don't really need that. Okay, this is definitely going to turn into something, though. Let's see. Let's see. We don't want to get too low because I want coal. Coal isn't down low, but it's going down. That's fine. That's fine. Let's see what. Let's see what we can get at here. I see some iron. I'll take iron all, all day long, too. I'll take iron all day long like this. But I want some coal. All right. Uh, we might as well grab this up since we're here. All right. We'll keep working our way down. This is very reminiscent of when we found the mine shaft in Dripstone Ravine. We just kind of headed down a place like this, and we ended up finding it. Okay, let's Finding a good cave system down there. Deep slate already. So that's not good for coal. <laughs> but let's let's see what we got. Let's see. But we're getting closer to diamond level. Not that we have a big diamond issue right now. Let's see. This is heading back up. How is this going to go? This is like some serious spelunking. <laughs> Tight crevices. Oh my gosh. And is this going nowhere? <laughs> oh boy. All right, this is going nowhere. Let's go back. We might have to go up top. I'll meet you up top and we'll find another cave entrance to go down. I think I've explored all of it here. I'll bring you back in if I find something else. Okay, back up this little area that we saw that we didn't want to go up right then, but there we go. We're out, and let's look for another good... Maybe we'll find more of a wide open one to get into. I just saw that one thought, well, let's just take a peek at that. So let's head this way and see if we can't find a bigger cave. All right, we're coming up on something here. Looks like a pretty classic ravine type of thing here. Let's take a look. I don't know if there's anything down there. This was wide open over here, though. Let's see if we can't look over here quick, and then we'll make a decision where we want to go down. 
There's some coal there. Looks like they all kind of tie together. So let's do this. Grab the coal and continue on. Maybe let's go back up where we were. It looks like that was maybe a little safer way down. So let's go check that out over there. Here we go. And we'll just pop on down here, get some food on our bar. I started doing some cooked beef. I was breeding up the cows a little bit and want to start having beef instead of jack of, er, jack of potatoes. Been watching too much uh, Python. Baked potato. Let's see. Here we go. There's some coal. We'll snag that up. All right, yep, this is definitely safer getting down here. This looks promising this way. I like this. Let's see where this leads. I think with this batch of coal, I'm just going to keep it in the villager area to trade with the toolsmith and the weaponsmith and all of those guys need coal to start with to get to get them leveled up. So I think that's what I'm going to do with all this coal. I'm not even going to put it in the furnaces back in Dripstone Ravine. I don't think they need it. Okay, we'll always take this lapis. I haven't seen that in a while. Let's snag that up. All right, this is opening into something. It has to. Come on. Lush cave. Open up into a lush cave, please. Please. Nothing. Well, what's up here? It looks like maybe this continues on up here. That's fine. Let's go up here. I think this is a bust again. Is this going? Oh, yeah, it goes out there. Let's just go out there. Hello. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna. There we go. Ugh. This is gonna be a color correcting nightmare. Getting everything bright enough for you guys to see it. That's okay. It's worth it. Something a little different with caving today. But let's go see what's. Oh, what's this now? Ooh. Uh, <laughs> is that where we were just down there? Were we just down that way? Oh, boy. All right, how do we get down there? Let's do, um, we could just do this. This makes me nervous. <laughs> uh -huh. There'll be a water source down there, right? I could grab it, like, do this thing. Oh, can't grab it. Nope, can't grab it, that's fine. Uh, let's just ride this thing down. There'll be water down here somewhere, right? Right? <laughs> Hope so. Huh. Lava. Ooh, let's go. Ooh, lava. Let's go towards the lava and see kind of what's over that way. Now, is will a lush cave have lava in it at all? I wonder. Like, is that a thing where if you see lava, you're nowhere near a lush cave? I wonder. I wonder. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to climb up there and snag this coal. And we'll see you back here in just a second. All right. I want to head that way. Let's do it like this. Kind of see what's on the other side of this lava here. I'll live on the edge. Ooh, there we go. More water. I already picked up a thing of water from back there, so that's good. Let's go see what's on the other side of this. This is kind of a, well, uh, not really a classic ravine. Usually there's like a river or something down low in a ravine, I think. Oh, interesting. Interesting. This might be a good way up if this isn't something we want to get into over here. Let's see. Yeah, there's nothing down here. Except for glow lichen. Whoop. Thank you. Let's try and head up this waterfall. Can I get these? Yep. Got them. Got them. 
Let's head up this waterfall and see what we can find up here. Is this going to bring us up towards the... What's over here? Oh, boy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I don't think there's anything up there to get out. Let's not do that again. Almost died. Hello. Hello. We got feather falling. Maybe we wouldn't have fallen. Wouldn't have died. Who knows? Who knows? Let's go this way and try to head back up. You know, let's actually, I think this is the waterfall. Is that the water that I put there? Maybe, maybe not. Let's go this way and see what's over here first. Doesn't look too promising, but I want to check it out. Oh, can't quite make that jump. That's all right. Yeah, not much going on over this way. Ooh, except for iron. Iron, ooh. Easily distracted. I'll take it. Maybe we can get that full beacon going if we want. <laughs> I just don't like the particle effects. That's why I didn't get the beacon going. For the most part, I just, there, you guys don't want to look at these particle effects. Ooh, what's down here? Oh, this is interesting. More, more iron. I wonder if there's a little bit, little section up a little higher too. Let's go that way and see if there's anything promising down that way. Right up here. What's this way? Oh, this is like a aquifer type of thing. It would be great as glow squid. That would be nice. Is there, I wonder if, oh, there's one. Yeah, RTX, they don't glow. I just saw his particles. Awesome. I do need a lot of gold. Am I picking it up? No. My inventory's full. What? Okay, let's go take a look. What do we got? One andesite. Gone. I'd rather have these. Yes. Let's see if there's more glow squid down here, huh? Ooh, coal. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. You know what I need to do is I need to go get my coal, more organized coal and iron and all that. Get them into blocks? That's what I'll do next. All right, so we'll do these. Block of raw iron, block of raw copper, block of coal. Perfect, that opened up some space. I don't. I definitely don't need these. I got plenty of those down, down in the, ooh, is that lapis? I think it is. I definitely have plenty of those down in the uh, spider farm there. <laughs> Way too much string and spider eyes. So let's grab this lapis. Oh, that's one thing we could have. Yeah, we can get those going too here. Let's put those together. Like that. Perfect. Well, let's kind of see what I wish. Let's see. I should have brought a night vision. A night vision potion would be good for this. I should have done that. Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, I'm going to pay the price, though, when I go to edit this. <laughs> Making sure you guys can see all this. What's up this way? Anything that we can see? Let's try land on there. There we go. Expertly done. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Is there anything up here? No. Nothing up here. All right. We're going to backtrack some, and I'll be right back with you. Okay, I'm back on top of what was that ravine. The ravine's down there. Went up the waterfall. Had a creeper explode right here. No damage, not too bad. I'm going to kind of keep working my way up here to see if we can't find another area. I want to try to get one more little cave area in with you guys. And then we'll go from there. I got to make some more torches. That's fine. Do that. And we got perfect. Uh, I don't want that on the bar. Where's the torches? Oh, I need to make the coal first. <laughs> oh, good job, Rax. Good job. Well, this looks kind of promising. So there's outside right up there, which is good. A quick exit. But this looks kind of promising this way. Uh, I want to do this. 
first of all. Snag that up somehow. This? No. Like this. There we go. There we go. Ugh. Ha <laughs> ha. There's got to be more than one, right? No? One. Oh, that was totally worth it. Totally worth it. And let's go down and snag these up. Put some light on the subject here. There we go. Oh, this is a good vein. I like this one. Let's go over here. Yeah, this is a good vein. Perfect. Just what we needed. Just what we needed. Perfect. And make sure we snag it all up like that. And what's down this way? There's a lot of light. Looks like there's some... Is there some lava up here? What's this? Or is it the sunrise or something? Oh, <laughs> look at that. I think it was the sunrise. That's pretty cool. That's pretty neat. All right, so let's go back down the other way. Oh, look at all that coal up there I missed. It was right above my head. Okay, we're going to head down there. And that's where we just were. We climbed back up and grabbed some more coal. I know. I'm just leaving that coal. I know, oh, I'm not just leaving this, though. It's already on the ground. Jeez. Oh, my gosh. Okay. This way. This way. There's more coal on the ground. It's just sitting everywhere. I must have had full inventory for too long. All right. Let's head down this way and see if we can't see something. Nothing there. This is the big way right down this way. See if we can't find a lush cave down here. I'm beginning to think that they don't exist. Like, deserts and lush caves are not going to be something that I find in this world. I just got that feeling. It's going to be amazing one day when I do find one. Maybe next season or something. But it just seems like I, it's not meant to be on this world. I've never seen a lush cave in survival. What do we got here? We got some iron. Do I dare say it? Do I dare say it? This is looking promising. I like the way this looks going down there. I haven't seen what's down there yet, but it looks like it opens up into something. So let's see. Because we haven't even seen a dripstone cave in this. What am I doing? <laughs> I got to take this easy stuff. We haven't even seen a dripstone cave in this episode at all. So there's been no cave biomes at all. So maybe there's something nearby. Maybe... There is something nearby. We haven't seen, we haven't gotten to a dungeon either. Those are supposed to be more, more prevalent now, right? Let's go this way. Okay, we'll go that like that for sure. Meant to do that. And still grabbing the stuff as we go. But I like the way that's looking down there. Maybe it's something, maybe. Okay, I'm going down the small area first for some reason oh this is a big area this is a big opening I, I i like where this is headed there is a lot of deep slate i'm done with coal i'm done with that so that's fine by me we'll go down to deep slate level okay and let's grab this stuff up too how much inventory space we got one left okay and we could probably consolidate some more. Let's see. Hmm, how do we get down there? I want to go down there. That's going to be the last thing we do today. I'm going to get down there. And we'll we'll see what's there. Okay, this is promising. This way. Oh, yep. Perfectly, perfectly done. Yes, I like that. And, oh, even bigger area. I like it. What's up this way, too? Let's go up this way first. Let's go up this way first. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Oh, iron. Perfect. Uh-huh. Not a lush cave. Just a lot of deep slate. This is so much deep slate. Okay, this way. 
Hmm. <laughs> um, yeah. Are we just going to do it? Where's the water? I saw water down there. Let's see. You guys, I probably color corrected this so well. You're like, yeah, there's water down there. Why can't you see it? Do I just jump? <laughs> oh, here we go. Take a deep breath. Hope for the best. There's water right below this. I think we'll be fine, but uh, yeah, not a problem at all. No problem at all. Okay. Whew. Now at some point I have to get back up, right? And we got to end this episode at some point as well. So no lush cave here yet, but what's over that way? That looks awfully bright. I don't know if that's going to go all the way up. That might just be an RTX lighting glitch thing. Let's go find out. That'll be our last thing today. Let's go find out what's over there. See what's going on. And grab that. That might go all the way up. This might be an easy, easy exit. It does. It does go all the way up, doesn't it? No, it doesn't. It's See, now the lighting fixed itself. This is monstrous, though. Look at this thing. Um, there, look at that mine shaft. Oh, wow. This thing is gigantic. I can't believe this. This thing is huge. I just wish it was lush. Can it just be huge and lush? Can we get that? Can we do that? Okay. What do we do? Um, this episode is getting to be too long. So I'll tell you what, I'm going to... Let's see if we get some good light here. Ooh, let's put down a torch. Get some good light. Right. Oh, yeah, backwards torch lighting. No problem. No problem at all. There we go. There we go. We'll end it facing the lava, too. Ooh, there we go. All right, so I'm calling it here for this episode. I'm going to, you know what? I'm going to record another episode right. Oh, there's a spider spider. Yep. Okay, so we're going <laughs> to, I'm going to start the next episode right now. I'm gonna just going to end this one here. I hope you have a fantastic day. We'll see you in the next episode, and I'm going to spend five years correcting lighting on this, but that's fine. I'm going to go check out that spawner in the next episode with you, and we're going to go check out the mine shaft. Two exploring episodes in a row. That's what we're doing. All right. I hope you have a fantastic day, and we'll see you in the next episode.